Can WWE 2K24 rewrite the biggest botch in professional wrestling history? Towards the end of 1996, Hollywood Hogan made the biggest heel turn the professional wrestling world has ever seen. This led to him joining the NWO and Sting to change to a whole new persona known to fans as the Crow Sting. Over the course of 15 months, we would see Sting before the show had started. Sting had shown up to talk to Hollywood Hogan and Eric Bischoff in a pre-match meeting. By the time that he left that meeting, Hollywood Hogan looked over to Eric Bischoff to say, he's not ready, brother. Eric Bischoff claims that his head was just not in the right place. He didn't have a tan, brother. There are obviously four different sides of this story and every single one of them are completely different. If you listen to Eric Bischoff's side, they basically had to pivot away from what they were originally going to do, which was a clean finish to Hollywood Hogan and Sting gets the one, two, three, walks out with the title, high fives all around. That was the finish that we should have gotten at Starcade 97. If you listen to Nick Patrick's side, when Nick Patrick showed up to the arena before he could even set his bags down and get into the locker room, Nick Patrick was confronted by Eric Bischoff saying Hollywood Hogan is going over. He then says later on that Hogan approached him saying, count it nice and slow, brother, nice and slow. Meanwhile, you had Sting in his other ear saying, make it rapid fire, brother, make it rapid fire. So instead of going with either Hulk Hogan or Sting's suggestion, he went with the boss's suggestion, which was just a regular count, one, two, three, right down the middle. Hollywood Hogan went in for the pin and got the clean one, two, three, which led to Bret Hart coming down and saying that this was a fast count. If you were a smart wrestling fan at the time, you knew what had just happened to Bret Hart in the WWE not even a month ago at the Survivor Series. The Montreal Screwjob, one of the most memorable events in professional wrestling history. So Bret Hart coming down to the ring only meant one thing. We're going to write this wrong. Unfortunately, to the fans watching at home, we all knew that this was a regular count. So Bret Hart coming down threw this whole thing off. Sure, the right guy went over at the end of the night. Sting walked away with the World Heavyweight title. We had a big celebration with the entire WCW locker room, holding Sting on their shoulders, celebrating. Sting hasn't spoken a word in over 15 months, and for some random ass reason, he yells Mamacita right into the camera. Great moment. I'm glad we got to go home but it still left a sour taste in everybody's mouth, even though this was the finish that everybody and their mama knew was gonna happen at Starcade 97. Today, we're gonna see if WWE 2K24 can write this wrong, and we're gonna see how they play this out. We got Starcade 97 Sting, thanks to Rebel Cause, and we got Nick Patrick, thanks to the icons of the ring. He's gonna be the special guest referee. Hollywood Hogan putting the NWO World Heavyweight Championship on the line, Starcade 97. Let's rewrite history. I got the sliders dialed in, man, but Sting has no offense within this on the outside. Come on, Sting, get him inside. So far, we got the referee bar. Nick Patrick's doing his damn job. We're not going to be uh, doing a slow count today, brother. We're going to be doing a normal count. No Bret Hart in this one. Sting's finally on the offense. Let's go, Stinger. Chop his ass down. So far, Nick Patrick's playing the role, man. He's got that referee bar going up, but this is AI we're talking about. This is AI, so let's see what happens. Oh, we got another count right here. One, two. Got the kick out from Stinger. Man, Hogan is just putting in work when it comes to this match. Stinger, though, coming with the comeback, hits Hogan down. <laughs> He's finished the comeback. He's in the corner. We're going to see the Scorpion splash. And he Oh, he looked like he was going for it. He looked like he was going for it. it, it Scorpion splash. Stinger splash lands. He goes for the count. One, two. Oh, man. There it is. Scorpion death drop onto Hogan. Is Hogan going to get a kick out of this? Is this going to be the... He's, he's dragging him to the middle because we all know Nick Patrick's going to... He, oh, he called it fair. Called it right down the middle. <laughs> right down the middle. Of course, when it comes to Hogan, brother, he's got all the power in WCW. You better call this fair, man. Hogan with the big boot. He's already going for the one, two. Oh, he kicked, barely kicked out. He barely kicked out of that one. This is this is rough. Hogan! Hogan! He's Hogan is hit the leg drop on Nick Patrick. What is going on right now? Hulk Hogan has just fully turned heel on us, man. He hit Nick Patrick for not screwing over Stinger, brother. This is the type of stuff we're talking about. Hogan is a dirty, dirty man. I don't know what in the hell just happened, but Nick Patrick is out of it. Hogan, 
with a choke slam to Stinger. This may be a disqualification. We may see a disqualification by, by Nick Patrick. Could you imagine doing a 15 month build up to get to Starcade to get a DQ, brother? Nick Patrick's not going to call this. He's not going to call this match. He's counting Sting. This man, this man is counting Sting out. I don't believe this. Stinger rolling back in. Hogan went and fetched it. Nick, pa Nick Patrick is throwing Hogan over. What is happening? What is happening? Nick Patrick. He... <laughs> He's going to throw him out and count him out in this. This is fantastic. This is better than Starcade 97 was. This is a great way to rewrite history. We're rewriting this thing for the greater good. Nick Patrick is on it. He's counting them both out, though. Stinger, get him inside the ring. We got it. We got to get this thing back on track, dude. So far, this match has been a straight, dusty finish. <laughs> I don't know what's going to happen. Nick Patrick's referee bar has gone down to half. But uh, we're, we're, we're still in it, man. We're still in it. Hulk Hogan hit the leg drop on the referee, which was the funniest thing that I've ever seen in this game from the AI. He was not taking no crap about that regular count, brother. Hulk Hogan with the... Hulk Hogan just low-blowed him. The referee didn't see it. This is AEW rules at this point. There's no DQ. What is going on? He didn't call the match. They're saying that they're saying that Nick Patrick's being fair right now. Hulk Hogan just hit Stinger with the low blow. This could do some major damage to Sting. I don't see him holding on with this because we all know Hulk Hogan is just a powerhouse when it comes to this game. And man, Stinger's just holding on by a thread. He's holding on by a thread, but this is this is entertaining for me to watch. Oh, that was by a thread. Sting almost won with the drop toe hold. Man, Sting's going all in though, man. He's holding his own in this one. I don't know if he has a signature. We don't have the HUDs up, but Sting is going in, dude. This could this could very well be the end for Hulk Hogan. This could be the history that we wanted. Uh oh, Hulk Hulk's hulking up, man. I hope he doesn't hit the Oh no. Oh no. Hogan with the. Oh no. Hogan got the leg drop. No rope break. It's a rope break. Saved by the rope. Nick Patrick doing his job. Called the rope break. He's not having any of this, brother. Sting is still in this, dude. Oh no. Choke slam. This is getting close. It's, 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 it. Oh, he, he missed with the big boot. Scorpion death drop. Rope break. Oh my God, what is happening here? He's building them up. We Can we see? He, here it goes. Tap him out. You better call it, Nick. Call it, Nick. Call it, Nick. Oh, Hogan is breaking out with the resiliency. What a match this is, man. Shout out to Big Righteous for these AI sliders. Nick Patrick is ignoring the pin. Nick Patrick is righting the wrong that he did 26 years ago. This is insane. Shout out to Big Righteous for these sliders, man. This AI is on point right now. They're actually putting on an entertaining match when it comes down to it. There we go. Get in the ring. Get him. Get him. Oh, there it is. Shout out to Roddy Piper. That sleeper hold. Nope. Oh, he's calling it. He put Hogan to sleep. This is the finish for Starcade. I don't believe this. This is so wild. There it is, man. Sting. The right person went over, and it was clean. I love the face paint fade in this game. That looks so good. What a match. That was so entertaining. There was a lot of shenanigans that happened in that match that I did not see coming. It was not on my bingo card. But let me know in the comments if you guys enjoyed this rewriting history video, and we will do more of them. Let me know in the comments what matches you would like to see us rewrite history on. We got more videos coming up and some awesome interviews lined up for this channel, so stay locked in. And if you want to learn how to set up a universe mode without having to edit anything, then check this video out right here. We'll see you on the next one. Take it easy. Have a great day.